Okay, this is part four on how to make a paper MPG-6. It is finally here after long last waiting. And sorry for the people who kept, like, being mean and cursing at me, but this is what we have done so far. Um, we've made the body right now. This is what it, look, what it will look like in the end, but there's going to be a part five showing you how to make a um, silencer, how to make a add-on scope, and how to make a flashlight. So, you, as you, as I say, you need scissors, paper, and tape. Okay. This is, I have already done it, but this is what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to tape... As I said in the up last video, you, you're supposed to tape this part right here, this part right here, to this part. So I'll just show you for right now. Tape this right here, tape this wobbly part that you should have to this. So watch. Watch as I do it. Tape this part right here. And now, do the same with the other one, the other side. Tape it right here. Okay. So now you have this. Okay. Now we'll be making the handle. You can take one sheet of paper to do this. It will it will only take one. So all you have to do is roll it up, make it to the size you want. So, hmm, right here. And now make it to the size you want. Okay, so I have the sides I want right now. After you have that, you will want to tape only to about a little less than half. A little less. You don't really need a ruler to know where a little less than half is on this. So, after you have taped that, you're going to want to get the tape straight, so straight, and now cut it at the very end of where you tape it. So see how the tape's right here? The tape ends right there. Cut it right there. So then your tube. You should have this. This will be your clip. Do not, I repeat, do not throw it out. After you have that, since it's a little less than half, you're going to want to cut it about, um, about this much. You're going to want to cut it about this much. What the? Okay. Whoever that was, something Michael. Sorry about that. Didn't want you to hear it. Um, so cut it about this much. Okay. After you have it like that, you're going to want to make it square. So all you do is flatten it, crease the edges. So to crease the edges, all you do is flatten it. Take this part of your scissors and cut it, make it go down like that. Now, take about, this is the confusing part people get screwed up on. You're going to want to do the same thing. So, like, now you have that, now you're going to want to do that. Now you're going to do the same thing and fold it. You don't, all you have to do is just flatten it out again. So then, you get it perfectly straightened. So, like that. Now you're going to want to tape this part down right here.
because it is all wobbly on the inside. So take a small piece of tape and tape this to down to here. So after you do that, do it with all four sides. So tape, tape it. Sorry if you couldn't see that. Okay. So once you have that done, you are going to want to tape this down to your gun. Tape this down to your gun. See how we have the back here? You're going to want to tape it. This is this is the front, the back. You're going to want to tape it about right about right here. So about right here. Here's the back. Now tape it only to this. Only to the bottom. So you're going to want to tape it a lot so it doesn't come off. Okay, so tape it about right there, like I have it. Do it with the other side, too. Now, keep taping it like that, so you get it good. So it's really strong, and you're not going to have any problems with it coming off. Because if you do, that's bad, and it's, like, really annoying to put it back. So, do that. Now do it with the other side. Okay, so... After you have that, it's going to be really tight on. Now you're going, now if you have like slack right there, you're going to want to tape that. Just tape that part, those parts. Now put this on the inside to flatten it. Sorry that I'm rushing, but I have to, like, school night, whatever. Tape it. Now you have your handle. Now we are going to be making the clip. All you have to do is roll this up. Pull it up and put it on the inside of this. And now you're going to want to make this bigger. So just hold that and make it as like tight as you can. And now re all you have to do is hold this and re outline it. So like recrease it. So now crease it like this. Now, crease this again. So pretty much all you're doing is recreasing the um, clip. So after you've recreased it, if you have like, if it looks ugly, all you have to do is cut that stuff off. Now tape it. All you do is tape this. Okay, so now you have the clip, but now we're going to be making the bottom. So all you do is take, like, if you have slack like me, all you do is take this and cut.
cut it on and put it on the bottom and tape it. So just like this. So watch part five. So if you want to learn how to make the all the other cool stuff and to learn to tape this on.